a little bit sad right now. A little bit sad, yeah. So, a little tiny piece came off of there. It goes there. So, yeah. We, uh, can try gluing it back on. I'm, I'm down to do that. This is supposed to melt the PLA, but wow, that like really sucks. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna try and glue this back on, but I have a feeling it's not gonna work. Um. Dang. That really just it's just a bummer. I'm pretty I like a piece of metal like music wire until into the part will work. Yeah. Probably. Just have to think it's not gonna be uh what's the word? What's the right word? I can't think of the right word. Ah. All right. Well, my fingers are sticking to everything now. Ah. It's everything. Yeah. I mean, it's 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 a it's a a weak point on it. It's a very thin part, which is you know. It has to be done. I'm not like angry with the design or anything. It just it's just a bummer that it happened. Did we put this in properly? I don't even know that I put it in properly. I think I put it in the wrong way. Son of a gun. So Alright, we're uh we're glued back, but I don't know that it's going to hold. What can I do to strengthen this? Definitely zero. Yeah, I, like I said, I don't... It's just one little point where there could be a lot of pressure applied. And uh, remember also, we had to open this hole up because the hole in this was not all the way open. So in doing so, we may have done something that um, weakened the structure there. Definitely, definitely a possibility. All right, uh, so this goes back in. This goes back in. We can, I think we can just, we can just go ham with the glue. I think what we're going to do, we're going to build a layer of glue to support. We're, we're, we're trying things, everybody. We're trying things. The baking soda that accelerates it. Interesting. All right. Uh, got like globs of glue on this. This is not smooth glue. It, it like it definitely globs up. I'm gonna open my window really quick for a minute here because I can smell things and it's not not necessarily ideal. So we're gonna we're gonna open that up for a few minutes. Man, this is this is a bummer. This is a bummer. I feel like this is probably what a lot of people go through when they build their own things. Which may in part be why I don't build my own things. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this goes there, right? No, other way. This goes there. So yeah. 
think uh, trying to figure out. So I'm just trying to. It totally caught me by surprise. All right, I'm smoothing out the glue, so hopefully it creates just kind of like a, a, a solid layer here. Is what I'm going for. But we'll see. We'll see. Get on the sides. All right. All right, Bruce, you're going to cross our fingers at this point. Like, that's that's pretty much what we're doing. Loctite Professional is amazing. I was recommended this by Grijas. Uh, this green green cap super glue gel for Gorilla. Oh, I didn't shake vigorously. That's awkward. Uh, do we use more because we didn't shake? Uh-oh. Awkward. That makes me think we need to reuse a fair amount of this on other things because I was not paying attention and was not reading things properly. So we're gonna, we're gonna use some more. And we're gonna go back and we're gonna hit the nut over here with some more. Because yeah, we didn't we didn't shake. We didn't shake vigorously, and that's apparently very important. Let's build the other portions, yeah. Let's jump full we'll jump a few pages. Thing shows better building materials and I believe it, but 429, yeah. Dude, those chairs are expensive. Those chairs are really expensive. They're nice, my brother has one, but man. They are not cheap. All right, so butt plate. Who was it that said we could move on to the, the back part of the blaster? Because you you're you're an all star. RCA RC master, you're an all star. Thank you for the idea. Uh, okay. To the butt, the stock core. No, no. Oh, this. Okay, this guy, that goes there, you screw that in, all right, we're getting somewhere everybody, we're doing things, I'm participating, uh, one of these, oh no, that's not the right one, we want this guy, no, that's not it. You want one of the screws that's not a, a flathead, but a Phillips, unless this image is just wrong, which is entirely possible because it looks like all of our screws are flathead. And uh, I don't have a flathead screwdriver with me. So that's, that's awkward. It's a little awkward. I guess we just go with this. Leather executive office chair. How very uh, executive of you. All right. uh, yeah, I don't have. All right. Well, I guess we're we're janking this up. We're using a knife as our <laughs> using a knife as our screwdriver. Don't recommend, kids. Don't recommend. Head immediately over your current non-adjustable two arms. Oh, oh. Yeah, that's rough. Yeah, definitely worth getting something new. Screw should be Phillips. There are no Phillips screws in here. Yeah, there are no Phillips screws. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I don't know what to say. Every screw in here is a flathead. I recommend knives for almost anything. They can be helpful, that's that's for sure. Using a screw. I mean it doesn't say what kind of screw, so I just have to assume 
and then you know a screw because well, that's what we're doing could use a small piece of polycarbonate I could if I had any definitely an option all right so that's there that goes on there right uh, we'll do that later okay we'll set this aside for now to the side grips this goes here along with I'm guessing this guy get caught up in the Ikea <laughs> oh man I think that glue is uh oof. All right. Uh, my apologies. I'm going to run the AC unit for just a couple minutes to kind of get that glue smell out of here because I'm getting a little lightheaded, and that's that's not a good sign. It's not a good sign. Uh, hopefully, it's not too loud. If it is, let me know. Is this it? There we go. That makes that makes more sense. That looks that looks better. Yeah, it looks proper. Okay, cool. So we need a threaded plunger rod. Oh, no, come back. Come back. Don't you dare. Don't do it. Don't fall off the edge. Life is worth living. Don't do it. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Let's let's not lose things. It would be nice. A better a butter knife be safer. Absolutely right. Like I said, do not do what I just did. Solved. Not even yet. Not even. We like I said, we, we ran into a bit of a problem. That problem being um, breaking the mag release. It was a bit awkward. It was a bit awkward. Sand this down because it's not sitting flush. And we definitely want things to sit flush. Looks like you buy it. It kind of, I mean, kind of is. Correct length of the rod. I think it's the correct length. I've got six threaded rods that all appear to be the same length. Oh, no. Oh, good catch. Good catch. There are two that are longer. 13-inch threaded rod. Okay. Uh... My tape measure is here. 13 inch. Okay. Good catch. Thank you for looking out for me. RCA, RC Master, you are you are on point tonight. Save him a butt. Okay. Bobo with a super chat $5. Bobo, thank you. Put a good amount of glue on your hands, then press your hands together for two minutes. <laughs> Lots of fun. Please do. Oh my goodness, Bobo. Oh my goodness. All right, let's, let's start putting the pins in this. There it is. There's the notification. That $5 super chat. All right, so I think we put pins in here. Pins. Short pins. All right, work with me. Got to do it at some point now. Jeez, I'd have no function in my hands for for who knows how long. I recognize that knife. Ended up getting the Colster recon. I highly advise against any recon or any uh, cold steel product. As someone who who got to experience better stuff. Oh my goodness. Cold steel is, is, is bad. It's bad. Like that knife is fun to open. That was why I bought it. But I should have bought a Benchmade. They're just so much better. So much better. Uh, try it again. Oh my goodness. Several people cut themselves in their deli. Oh, that sounds horrible, Vaporeon. 
That is not something I would wish on someone. And that sounds that sounds awful. Alright, so those those are in. That goes in there. That goes in there. And this also has the chubby guy cutting it. How can it be bad? That's you know, that's a good point. They are such an American company. How should we advertise our products? I don't know. I mean, we could we could talk about the the science behind it, the things like that, and all the all the research and development we've done. That's a lot of work, though. You know what? Let's just cut a side of beef. I got it. Yep, that's it. We're cutting a side of beef, and we'll cut some filled water bottles too while we're at it. That that is your cold steel marketing team right there. No bad knife can come from that company. <laughs> Let me put it this way. I lost the tip of my knife shortly after getting it on the carpet of the store opening boxes. That is that is how uh, how strong quote unquote it was. To watching what was America said, dude, America uh, Bobo's videos are fantastic. Absolutely. The stuff he makes is awesome. And I can completely sympathize that Bobo definitely was one of the people I watched heavily when I first got into the hobby. And he kept my attention and interest in me like, oh, these are really cool things that people are doing. Welcome back, Tomer. At least they didn't cut the cheese. Oh my goodness, Vaporeon. Why are you not going in. What is, uh, what's the deal? What's the hang up here, buddy? Hey, hey, hey. All right, let's, let's, can we even get one through here? I see we have another issue here, like we did with the mag release. That's not good. It's not good at all. So we're tempted to buy Cut three corners. Oh no! Don't do it. You're better than that, pirate. All right, there we go. That's through. Yeah, ooh, that's through. Okay, it should fit now. Quote unquote should. Come on. Pitchman sold in. Grias is a real. Oh no. Greenhouse, you bullying Bobo. All right, there's one in. Okay, can I get the other one in? All right, we're in. We're in there. Oh, and I lost a pin. Okay, we were in there. He smells of elderberries. CRKT, nice, nice. CRKT does not make too bad stuff. Like uh, they've they've had some stuff that was uh, licensed by other companies, I believe, if I remember correctly. All right. Uh, it's flush with the exterior surfaces. What? Oh, flip over. But if I flip it over, it's going to fall out. Like, what? What? I don't... I don't quite follow on that one. Seems a bit odd to me. Let's, let's, let's see here. <clears throat> Standoff. Now I want to buy a knife. I know. Knives, there's some cool knives out there. Oh. Besides custom made. Bench made. Bench made is the best knife company to go with. Can't be a little fly. Uh, bench made is who I recommend up and down every day of the week for knives. 
Um, outside of that, if you want interesting designs, but don't mind so much that the quality of steel is not as nice, uh, you can go with Spyderco. Um, Kershaw is also not bad. They're more affordable. You're not going to get, again, the same high quality of steel, but you're going to get decent steel. It's going to be better than this. Better than cold steel. Uh, who else is decent? Those are the ones that come to mind. Granted, it's been years since I worked there, so it's possible some of these companies have gotten better and or worse. Uh, I know Josh from Bay Area Nerf has stayed up on the knife game, so he may have a good amount of knowledge on all this stuff. I don't think I want to glue this yet. I don't think I feel comfortable gluing everything in. Uh, all right, so standoff. We have one. No, we have two. Stand okay, that looks that looks more right. Standoff goes in there, and screw goes in here. Uh, Lost Minecraft, this is my first Nerf stream. I've streamed a fair amount of gaming, both here on YouTube and on my Twitch. But, uh, oh, oh, that was silly. But, uh, yeah, it's my first... First stream of Nerf stuff. The guy who popularized the word weeb weebo. Really? iPhone 8 is best knife. Interesting. Uh don't have a flat screwdriver. All right, everybody. I unfortunately must get a flathead screwdriver. Okay. Sorry about that. I got the screwdriver and then shortly after I grabbed it, I was like, oh yeah, I don't have a, a flathead screwdriver in, in my drawer. And yeah, I do. But, uh, I'm going to use the one that I just grabbed because then it makes me feel like I didn't waste my trip out there. All right, that is in there. Okay. Good. We'll tighten that later. James Gone's post Pokemon. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Catch up on chat here. Pirate Johnson, vote Baja Blast. <laughs> nice. Thank you for the $2. I really appreciate that, man. I'll pink your guy, my dudes. Oh, Bobo. Oh, Bobo. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. What am I doing here? Uh, reading the instructions. I was distracted by the Baja Blast. I've not had a Baja Blast in who knows how long. About five years. Uh, because I can't have... Well, I can't have the things I want. Um, so now we need trigger. Yeah, that pink trigger. Oh, baby. Uh, this goes here. On to this. Really? The trigger pull is that light or that short? That's crazy. Okay, that's crazy. We take our two other extension springs here. Worker darts or darts cut in half like oranges for accuracy. Uh, Brent, right now people seem to be pretty big on the worker Gen 2 half darts. Picture's supposed to be, I'm way cuter. So that, okay. Fun fact about that picture. Someone from my Twitch streams actually did that on my birthday as a birthday present. And it blew my mind. Like he just randomly was like, hey, here's this, uh, I drew this of you today. And I was like, what? That is so cool. Oh, yeah, that, like, I don't know. Things like that just, they blow my mind. So it's like, I have to use this. All right. Uh, and this goes. Oh, I need to, okay, got it. I need this piece here. Correct? That looks like it. Ooh, that, that definitely needs some cleaning. We're using our spring to clean this piece. That makes sense. Pink is power. You are absolutely correct. Bobo and I are both part of the, the pink revolution. There we go. I'm just going to 
peel some of that off. Uh, so this piece goes here. And then we grab the, oh, nope. back. Can't hold all the limes. So you gotta put them in the coconut. You put the lime in the coconut and mix it all up. Okay. We're good. It feels pretty good. If you're trying to make a hot glue, <laughs> that's pretty good. That's pretty good, Zerger. Uh, can you use PayPal for chat? I actually have no idea how Super Chat works, Tiger, but it just, I enabled it earlier before I started the stream. Um, you keep your money. Don't, don't waste your money on me. I appreciate that, though. I appreciate, like, it's such, whenever someone does, like, Super Chat or, or donations or tips, and I, it, I don't know. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. I'm like, why, why are you, thank you. I don't understand. Can't wait to praise the Pink Revolution, the LS. Oh. Yes, I want. I so I have plans. I have plans to do a Fabu long shot as well, and it's gonna be a nice one. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to doing the paint job on it. It may be hand painted. Uh, Clowny only has two hands to make channel art with. <laughs> Clowny's art's crazy. That dude is so talented, so talented. All right. Feel less spacer. Grip three. Rawr, get in there. It's your home. You too good for your home. Okay. Good. Sponsor, I can afford two dollars. <laughs> oh no! I just hit the mic a bunch. I'm so sorry, everybody. Man, Tiger throwing around that jet money. All right, this these two then go here. Take my Bobo. You spoil me. Thank you. Ah, get in there. Work with me. Love that sound. So, about that sound as well. That do do. Uh, when I was in high school, my friends and I, and uh, yeah, friends and I, we were sitting around playing Legend of Dragoon, an old school PlayStation uh, RPG. And we started discussing all of the like kind of cliches and, and silly things that were in every RPG of that time. And we were like, man, we should make video. We should make a video about this. So we made a video kind of parodying all of like the popular RPG memes before memes were a thing. Buy lunch and think of me. You know what? I will do that, Bobo. I'll make it happen. I'm going to get a nice chicken sandwich with like some nice. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Um, yeah, so. So basically, like, we did this whole video, and it was it was entertaining for us, but he did all the sound effects by, like, via his mouth. So, like, the menuing, that's from, like, menuing around. It's like, doodly, doodly, I, I don't know. It's just those little things. I was like, oh, I'm going to use that. I'm going to use that. All right, this is a 13-inch one still, yeah. 13, yep, yeah, good. In the hole it goes... Bo is a nice guy. He likes to he likes to joke around and mess around and, and you know meme it up and everything. But he really is a nice guy. I like having him as a friend. Uh, trying to get you viewers are saying maybe whoa whoa pirate pirate. This is a family friendly stream. It's a family friendly stream here. Um, all right. Screw. Three ACA fumes, whoa. Pick is AC Gen 3. I have not tried any of them. I'm going to have to start trying all these different darts. I have some um, worker Gen 1s on their way from... I placed an order 
So I did I did the light take unboxing, and I've got a video I'm going to be working on for uh, the light take unboxing I did a little while ago. <sighs> Fun fact. The purpose of the light take order that they sent me was I, I told them, you know, I want to do this video um, if you guys are willing to, you know, help me do that when they reached out to me. And the video was an analysis of all available mags and what the best magazine for you is for your play style or your loadout. And uh, if you guys follow Coop, you'll know that a couple days ago he posted a video on magazines and breaking them down. And I was just like, well... I guess, I guess we're changing that. So basically, it's going to be a breakdown of light take magazines now. Um, but yeah, I have some darts on order. I did a second order because I wanted to do an order uh, from the, the view of a consumer who actually spent money on their order and everything and review the service from that perspective as well. Uh, so I have some worker Gen 1s and what I thought were going to be the sweet oranges, but I ordered the wrong ones. I think they have hard tips, so I'll find it when they get here, but yeah. Unfortunate on the land, I, I screwed up. Um, okay. I have no feelings for light take. I don't know what it is. Just don't care if it makes sense. I mean, yeah. Get it? Like, not everyone's going to be into, like, you know, their prices have been good so far, so I've been like, hey. And they haven't done me wrong yet. We'll see how the package is when it arrives. But I know, uh, I think it was Ben's Mods or Biggs, I think, had some issues. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see how my order is when it comes in. All right, so now we've got this guy and this guy and this guy. Go on. Please go on. This need to go further back, I guess. Color tips, they're red, which is why I think I got the wrong ones. I think I must it up. These are not very far out. You know what? Let me actually, I don't want to touch that because if I touch that, it's going to wobble for the next like five minutes. And I don't want to make you do that. Yeah, it was weird to see that. I, I agree, but like it, it that's why it threw me. I was like, oh wow, I didn't expect that. So it was it was good information to have. Um, which is why I'll be, you know, curious to see how my order is when it comes out. It was on uh, Instagram. This is not quite does not quite fit. Whoa, velocity! Oh, thank you for the five dollars, man. Seriously, that is very kind of you. You guys are crazy. I appreciate it immensely, though. Like seriously. But now I can't get this to fit. Does it? Does it need to go in? I, I mean, I assume it does. It would, it would make sense. It's not. Hawkeye raid. Oh, what's up? How's everybody doing? Hawkeye, if you're in here, thank you so much, man. I hope you had a good stream. The only one, oh, that's all I appreciate it, Meowstic. And Yoda, man, thank you so much for the kind words. If it's a dull red, you might be fun. They sell probably the same diameter as Demolisher Missile. Hmm. What's up, Dragonzoid? How you doing? Uh, so for everyone coming in right now, just a heads up, uh, we were assembling the, the caliber, and we put the mag release on. And I pulled it a couple times and set it aside, pulled it a couple more times, and it snapped. So this little, like, the, the thin point snapped. So I glued it back on, and we're waiting for it to, to kind of hold, and I'm hoping it'll, I don't know, be serviceable? So we'll see. We'll see. Hey, Mod Squad, what's up? Thank you so much. Oh, all right. So, yeah, we're, we're kind of... I think I need to sand this a little bit, maybe? Because this is not... Not fitting this uh, tube here. Should swap video thumbnails and stream? Oh, no. Wow, Bobo, way to be confrontational. I think it might be 
part of it is there's little little bits here from the 3D printing process that have not been kind of cleaned off. I realized I totally forgot to respond to Michelle. I got her message and I forgot to respond to her because well, we're doing this, so hopefully she's not like, why why are you why are you online but no respond? Yoda, thank you for that. I honestly I people should watch whoever they enjoy. Like I don't I don't see problems with with other, you know, bigger name content creators. Just different styles. Everyone has their, you know, preferred style. Pink is boss. It's true. It's very true. <laughs> All right, Brent. All right. Let's see if that it wasn't much. Let's see if it's enough to clean it up. Oh, it was, I think. Almost. Almost. So close. So close. Thank you, Armods. I thought they were fabulous. It's gotta match the rest of my blasters. It's true, Bobo's got it right. I don't want to take too much off here, so I'm trying to like not sand with a, a bunch of the paper and just get little bits and kind of clean it out. There we go. We in there. We in there like swimwear? I don't. I don't I ignore that. <laughs> I just, I, I don't know what, what I was trying to even say. Uh, oh, Bobo trying to start up a fight. Man, what an instigator. All right, this goes on. This, this goes on. There we go, this goes on. Travis, you are noticed. What's up? So maybe these can come out a wee bit. Come on. Get out. Rah. Work with me. I just want to love you. I would not fight yeah, for real, Dragon Zoid. But he's just he's just a big he's just a big teddy bear. Ugh. Okay, now I think we have enough in there. Uh, so we have that we need to put hex nuts on. Okay, and we go with a 14 inch rod. I mean, one of these longer guys. We in there like swimwear? It is it? So it is. Okay, like it came to mind, I was like that. I feel like I've heard that before, but man, I, I must be wrong because something about it didn't sound right. But I must it must have been right. All right, so we got these little like clampy nuts. These hex nuts, do these hex, hex nuts like they, they don't seem like they're messing around? Like, dang! A Hawkeye is here. What is up, Hawkeye? Thank you for the raid, my friend. I hope I hope you're streaming well. I hope the sanding is nearing its completion. I mean, these must be the hex nuts because there's literally no other hex nuts in here that can fit. So these must be it. Do, 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 do. We're screwing you on. Ah, oh, I see. So they grab on, and then, man, I like that. I like that. Haters mean doing something right. Uh, it's, it's, it's actually kind of true. Because, you know, there is that subsect of haters that literally just hate people that are successful. Uh, because they are doing something that they are not. So, you know. You try epoxy sculpt. That's, I keep hearing everybody talking about epoxy sculpt as, like, the new hotness. Uh, 
Uh, let me give one second, everybody. Uh, but yeah, the, I don't know. I I I want to try a uh, an integration. I feel like it would be interesting. It would be a lot. But I don't know. I, I, I feel like I need to start smaller than that. I forgot the foam pad. It doesn't say foam pad yet on here. The foam pad goes on after, I think. All right, so yeah, we're putting on these little guys. Get, get, get on there. Get up, get on, get on, get up, get, get, hey. Travis, thank you. Cures slower. Oh, so you have more time to work with it? That seems beneficial. Incredibly on point, though. Blood on the dance floor. I do not... Reference is lost on me. Reference lost on me. Rip. Beauty parts, PLA, or APs? I think they're PLA. Uh, I don't know if someone can confirm or deny that, though. Yeah, having more work time definitely sounds pretty awesome. Because knowing me, it'd be like, oh, I done messed it up. All right. I guess, uh, I guess rip me. Ah. Uh, okay. This will end. This. Okay. I, I'm pretty sure it's not, like, intentional. I'm pretty sure it's being blown out. If I can get an angle right. But, like... The way the 3D print settled on this, the layers work, it almost looks like a wood grain. It's too bright. And like, I don't know, it's kind of interesting to me. Oh. Oh. Come on. No. Are you not, are you not big enough? It's getting there, Mod Squad. I'm just concerned about that mag release. Very concerned about the mag release because, well, we broke it. You just feel like because you printed. Oh, that's that's a good reason. Oh man, we're gonna have to thread this entire thing. Use Gorilla Gel. That's what I'm using right now. Man, this is such a tight fit. We have to literally screw this thing on. Okay. Ah, that only took way too long, way too long.